the founder of the defunct UT Bank, Prince Kofi Amuabeng, and five others facing trial for the collapse of the bank have also been granted bail. The six accused persons have, among other offences, been charged with fraudulent breach of trust, deceit of a public officer, and fabrication of evidence. Another report by Kofri Tanam. The first accused, Johnson Pande de Siama, was said with a 60 million self recognition bill. The fifth accused, Catherine Johnson, also secured the bill of 20 million cities with two sureties. The rest of the accused persons, Prince Kofi Amoabe, Raymond Amanfo, UT Holdings Limited, Robert Kwesi Ama, were given the bill in the tune of 6 million cities with two sureties to be justified. The court asked them to deposit their passports at the registry of the court. The Bank of Ghana on August 14, 2017, announced the revocation of the license of UT Bank and ordered GCB Bank to take over its operation because it had severe capital impairment. Provisional figures released by the central bank showed the total liability of UT Bank stood at 850 million cities while its total asset was pegged at 112 million cities. The case has been adjourned to March 26.